Welcome to the Cabral Concept, where board-certified naturopath and integrative health practitioner Dr. Stephen Cabral shares how he was diagnosed at the age of 17 with a life-altering illness and given no hope for recovery. It was only after studying and traveling all over the world did he discover how to combine ancient Ayurvedic healing practices with state-of-the-art naturopathic and functional medicine to fully rebalance the body and re-energize it with life. It's time to discover how to get well, lose weight, and finally feel alive again. And now, here's your host, Dr. Stephen Cabral. Welcome back, everyone. Great to be here with you today. Excited to get into today's show because one of the questions that I always get, and I would say as an industry in general, not just me, is that it's really difficult to eat healthy and organic on a budget. So there's no doubt about it. You know, it might take maybe just a little bit more premeditated thought, but it's actually pretty easy. And I've actually had colleagues of mine say, it's really difficult for people to find healthy foods and to put meals together and to meal prep, especially if they're busy while trying to purchase organic. And it's just, it's impossible to do. And What I wanted to share, and I've actually did this, uh, I talked about this a little bit on episode 1998, last Monday's show, not this week, but the Monday before, is just sometimes we have to just stop and say, listen, I know there's a lot of overwhelm, we're all so busy, especially if you're going to school right now, or you have kids, you have a family, you have a job, like there's always so much going on. I don't know a whole lot of people who have a whole lot of time unless you're retired and you're relaxing. Most people are busy. They don't have a lot of time to meal prep. They don't even have a lot of time to think about their meals, uh, let alone try to come up with something healthy and organic and really good for them. So what I wanted to do today was make it really easy. So I'm going to give you a complete shopping list to download or to just copy and paste off of your phone or computer. You can take it with you anywhere. But remember, my job in the Cabral concept is not even to tell you exactly what to do. That's not my job. My job is to open up possibility and to allow you to see That living a healthy lifestyle, emptying your rain barrel, getting healthy, losing the weight, living longer, stronger, does not have to be difficult. It honestly doesn't. Don't listen to all the people who just say, it's, you know, they're keeping us from healthy food. They're keeping us from this. Listen, yeah, in a way they are. There's no doubt about it. Like, People like Bill Gates are buying up all the farmland, and and we have so few small farmers anymore. There's no doubt about that. I mean, that's fact. However, we can still support organic. We can still support our local farmers. We can go to farmer's markets if you get the opportunity. Regardless, I'm going to show you today that you can eat healthy and organic because the entire menu I give you today is all organic or wild in nature, meaning that wild grown, okay? So I just want to dive right into it. So we're going to absolutely do that. And again, I'm going to link everything up today uh, for you, and I'll give you that link towards the end of the show. So let's get right into it. Not only did I uh, put together the meals, but I actually put together the pricing of every single one so that you can see exactly what it's going to cost. Because remember, I'm not here to tell you exactly what to do. I'm here to open possibility and allow you to substitute your favorite foods. Because if I go over the list right now and you say, oh, well, you know, I can't eat tomatoes because it's a nightshade. I get it. Substitute another vegetable or fruit technically for a, uh, for a tomato, right? Although it doesn't eat like a fruit. So don't, definitely don't consider it that in terms of food combining. But this show's not about food combining. So just substitute your favorite food. You're a vegan. Oh, great. We've got vegan choices. Uh, you're Mediterranean. Great. We have fish choices. Fish choices. You only eat meat. Okay. Well, that's a different show. All right. But for the most part, this is a great day in the life of kind of how I would eat. Uh, I've, di- I've done shows on exactly how I eat a day in the life of my Mediterranean diet. It's called. I'll link that one up today too at the show notes. And um, this is a very healthy diet as well. So the majority of people are going to be able to really follow this. All right. So just remember, you can substitute substitute your own favorite food, keep it within the confines of this nutrition plan, and you're going to be able to keep your nutrition to $15 a day, which is unbelievable when, again, people say, I can't afford to eat healthy. Listen, it's difficult to eat food in general for under $15 a day. If you can do it, more power to you. I did it in college, but again, I was in college, and I was eating things like a can of tuna on top of rice and olive oil, excuse me, and even that was about $5 a meal, right? So it's very difficult to eat for less than $5 a meal. You go to McDonald's, it's still going to be $5 to $7 a meal, right? 
Uh, you go to Starbucks for a coffee. It's $5 for a coffee, right? Like it's literally, if I go to a Starbucks, like it was at the airport two weeks ago, I said, okay, I'm just going to get a, a cold brew or whatever it was. And I got that at the airport and it was like $5.57. I remember that. And again, I don't, I don't mind paying the $5. I don't usually go to Starbucks. I don't usually drink their coffee. For sure, I make my own and, and I love my little concoction in the morning. But it was $5.57. That's as much as one of these meals, all right? So let's put all this in perspective. Uh, you can do this, no doubt about it. All right, so remember, everything, if I don't state it, is organic or wild and I'm going to put it all in there. W one more thing before I get into this. Where did, I, where did I get the pricing from? I actually got it all from Whole Foods. Why did I choose Whole Foods? Because it's the most expensive grocery store out there. You walk out with a bag, and if you're not careful, that bag is $100, right? So if you go in there for a lunch, one of those, um, you know, they have their, their meal bars, right? Their hot meal bar, the salad bar, all that. You walk out there with a $15 lunch, right? Because they weigh it, and it's like $1,000 a pound, and you know, that you walk out, and it's an expensive meal. It can be delicious, but it's still an expensive meal. So we're going to give you all that in three meals for the day. And this is more of a weight loss based plan. Again, everyone's plan's a little bit different. I know if you're on the detox, our detox is different. If you're on our fat loss plan, it's different. But just keep that in mind. It's a pretty good overall nutrition plan geared a little bit more towards weight loss for sure. Uh, and I have some notes at the end if you want to use this more for uh, weight maintenance or maybe even weight gain. All right. So I've got lots of notes in here along the way. Uh, that is the preface for the show. I feel like I've gotten it all in there, all the disclosures. Now let's get into it. $15 Let's get started. All right, breakfast. What is breakfast? Remember, all of these meals have to be no prep. Oh, that's another, another disclosure. I'm making this so anybody can do it, okay? There's no excuses. My job is to take away your excuses. That's my job. That's why sometimes people don't really jive because I'm taking away all of the excuses. Like, oh, I can't eat healthy. Well, no, you can't eat healthy. Oh, I can't exercise. No, you can exercise. Like, And then we just give them ways to do it and make it simple, right? Make it simple. Like I talked about in episode 1998, take away the friction, make it easy eliminate the excuses. And once you've done that, then it's just a choice. You can just say, no, I don't want to eat this way or live this way. That's okay too. And I support you with that. Remember, but I just want to make sure that if you want to, you have the ability to do so. All right. Now we're really getting into it. Breakfast. It's going to start with one cup of berries. Okay. One cup of berries, blueberries, mixed berries, any type of berries. And to make it easy, we're going to keep them frozen. You're just literally going to keep a bag of frozen wild blueberries or frozen mixed berries in your freezer. That's it. You're going to have one fourth cup of raw macadamia nuts. All organic, remember? Okay. Uh, sorry, the one cup of berries is $1.50 maximum. I put in the high price there. One fourth cup of macadamia nuts. And I'm even going to give you the different brands so you can see exactly what I pulled from. It doesn't mean you need to use this brand. I want to be really clear in that as well. Uh, but I want to make sure that you know uh, where I pulled all of these prices from specifically. So we're going to go in right to my Whole Foods cart right here that I put together for you. And uh, let's see where it is. Okay, so this is Aurora uh, Organic Raw Macadamia Nuts, all right? And uh, we've got the one-fourth cup of berries, sorry, the one cup of berries. This was the Whole Foods brand uh, Organic Berry Blend, all right? That was their 365 Frozen Organic, and it was strawberries, blueberries, and blackberries, all right? So I didn't even put in the Wyman's, which is less expensive than that per serving. Okay, and then, so you've got your carbs, right? Your berries. You've got your healthy fat. You've got your macadamia nuts, a monounsaturated fat. You've got your water that we're going to make this smoothie out of, which is free because you're going to have a water filter already ahead of time. And you have an all-in-one powder, okay? An all-in-one powder is going to have all of your vitamins, all of your minerals, uh, your electrolytes. It's going to have some good fiber in there, a vegan-based protein or whatever protein you'd like, all right? So now, even if you don't do any other supplements besides this, you've got all your vitamins and minerals for the day. I mean, it's pretty remarkable. And it has 15 grams of protein. The one that I use is called the Daily Nutritional Support by Equalife. It's one that I formulated. You're welcome to use whatever one you want. Honestly, it's not about that. But put that in there because now you have your protein, which is about $2 per serving. But it also has all of your vitamins, your minerals, your electrolytes, um, and antioxidants, and so much more, right? Okay, so we take the $2 for the all-in-one, $1.50 for the berries on the highest 
side. And we take the uh, 120 for one fourth cup of macadamia nuts, which by the way is plenty. It has 23 grams of, pr- of, of fat. That's plenty. And your water, uh, your frozen berries acts as your ice cubes. Okay, we're done. We make a beautiful smoothie. You put it in a big mason jar and you're out the door in five minutes. What do I do? Much to my wife's dismay sometimes when I'm in a rush, I put the blender in the sink, fill it with water and I'm out the door. I'll wash it later. Uh, So again, like you're out the door in five minutes. Your partner might not be thrilled. I get it, but we're talking about the dollars and cents here today. All right, so breakfast is now $4.70. We did it, all right? So it's under $5. All right, now lunch is up next. Remember, no prep, easy. Throw it in a um, nice glass or a nice to-go container in the morning. Is there any prep? Is there any time? No, this is going to take you three minutes or less. Okay, you can do it the night before if you need to. You're going to take three cups of an organic spring mix. Remember, we want to be satiated as well, right? The one that I'm pulling from is called Organic Girl Baby Spring Mix. We're going to take three cups of that for $1.75. We're literally going to use half that container. All right, we're going to cut up and dice one tomato, ideally an organic or heirloom tomato. It's all natural, right? Great. How much does that cost? 60 cents for one whole tomato. That's a lot of tomato, right? So we're going to put that all in there. What if you don't eat tomatoes? No problem. Put in something else, right? Whatever you want. Put in cucumber. All right. We're also going to get a carrot because we want crunch to the salad, right? So we got the soft lettuce leaves. We got the soft tomato. We need some crunch. So what are we going to do? We're going to take a carrot, a whole carrot, 60 cents, and we're going to dice it up, right? So now we've got carrot chunks. We've got something with some texture. People love texture when they have a meal. And we, now we need some healthy fat, right? So what do we need for our healthy fat? Well, let's do some olive oil. Easy, right? Easy dressing. Squeeze a little lemon if you'd like. Totally up to you. Olive oil, 10 cents. I put it at 20 cents. So 20 cents for the serving of two tablespoons of olive oil. Now, again, that's about the same as the mac nuts. That's about 24 grams of fat. Now we're looking at our protein. We need a protein for our meal, right? So what are we going to do? Well, you could do what I do, which is hemp hearts for that plant-based lunch if you would like it. Uh, 15 grams of protein is about $3. Uh, 10 grams of protein, you would take that down to about $2.33 or so. Yes, right around there. Uh, $2 actually, $2 for 10 grams. Um, I put it at three because I want you to get 15 grams of protein minimum per meal. Uh, that's just a safeguard just for, you can always add more, no doubt about it, but I just want that as the minimum for breakfast and lunch. And we'll be doing more at dinner, which will be around 30 grams. Uh, or you can do sardines for even less money at $2 and 33 cents, a whole can of sardines packed in olive oil. Now you don't even need to use the olive oil because you have olive oil with your wild sardines. All right. So the sardines I was looking at, I believe was wild planet at $2 and 33 cents for the entire container. What do you do for those sardines? What do you do for the spring mix? Well, the organic oil is triple washed. Great. So we're set. The tomato, wash it. The carrot, wash it. Uh, peel if you don't want, if you want less lectins, peel the outside of the carrot just with the back of a knife or a peeler. Uh, olive oil, no prep. Sardines, no prep. You tear it open and you dump it on top of the salad and you're out the door. $5.53 for lunch. Organic lettuce, organic tomato or heirloom, organic carrots. Uh, we've got organic first pressed, cold pressed in a dark bottle, olive oil, right? That's what I always talk about with olive oil. And then you've got your organic hemp arts or you've got your wild sardines. $5.53. We are now up to a grand total of $10.23 for the day. All right, let's keep moving because we have dinner. We've got one more meal. Look, we're not even doing two meals a day. We're doing three meals for $15 for the day. So let's check it out. All right, one to one and a half cups of rice cauliflower. If you've never had rice cauliflower, it's fantastic. I do it at lunch um, sometimes uh, as well because I'll, I'll, I'll let me share exactly why. Okay. This is, you might think, well, this is starting to sound like a gourmet dinner. Trust me, it's not. You buy frozen organic riced cauliflower. Let me give you the brand. I'm pretty sure it's Whole Foods. Yes, it's 365 frozen organic riced cauliflower. If you've never heard about it before, it looks like rice, big, thick pieces of rice, but it's made from cauliflower. So now we're looking at low carb, high sulfur-based cruise surface vegetable. What could be better, right? So now we're good to go. We get a lot of it. Cook a cup and a half. Enjoy. What about broccoli? Broccoli is anywhere, uh, sorry, the rice cauliflower, 50 cents to 75 cents. The whole bag is $2.29. It's going to last you 
at least three to four servings, or probably three to four servings for me, three servings. Uh, what about broccoli? Broccoli, a lot of different brands to choose from. Honestly, you can get frozen, you can get fresh. Totally up to you. I usually get the broccoli florets, just the tops. And oh, for, again, you can just get them frozen if you want. $3.59 for the Whole Foods base brand. So more than cauliflower. Uh, and what do you get for that? Well, uh, you get it down to $0.60 cents to $1, depending if you're doing one cup to one and a half cup. Why did I put in the one to one and a half? If you're not used to eating vegetables and you eat three cups of vegetables at a meal, your stomach may not feel that good. Even though it's good for you, you might not feel that good. So start at one cup of each and then work up to one and a half. It is also going to be less money, right? All right. Uh, wild salmon. Wild salmon is part of this $15 day. Amazing, right? Well, how do you do wild salmon for only $4 per piece? You can, per- you can pre-purchase or purchase the previously frozen, so frozen, wild caught salmon fillets. By Whole Foods, of course, it's from Whole Foods, right? You can always get your own. Um, so now you're getting wild caught salmon fillets, and you're getting about six per pack, and it's about $26 or so, 25, 24 to 27, depending on, I guess, the week and the, the price of fish. Uh, you're looking at about $4. That's it. So $4 for a piece of wild salmon, you're going to get somewhere around 24 to 30 grams of protein, depending on the size of that piece of salmon. So plenty of protein. And then we need our healthy fat. So if you want to do it for less expensive, add some olive oil and a little sea salt to your salad at lunch, olive oil, a little sea salt to your dinner and your vegetables. Absolutely delicious. Squeeze some lemon or some lime on top. Lime on top of salmon is phenomenal. Try it out. That costs you negligible amount uh, of money there. If you want to go big, though, you can add a avocado, right? Or half an avocado. A half an avocado is about a dollar twenty-five. Keep the pit in the other half. Seal it in a silicone bag or a bag of your choice. Put it in your fridge; it'll still stay fresh for the next day as long as you keep that pit in there. Little side tip. All right. So, what does dinner cost you? Anywhere from five dollars and thirty cents to a maximum of $6.90 if you're going to go with the uh, one and a half cups of each, three cups total of your veggies uh, instead of your two cups and your avocado versus your olive oil. So again, if you're someone that can spend an extra $1.60, great. Now you can get your avocado and you can do even more vegetables, which is another full cup of veggies, which is kind of nice. So We've got our $4.70 for breakfast, which includes all of our vitamins, minerals uh, for the day, Uh, 15 grams of protein there. We've got our uh, lunch at $5.53 for a total so far there of $10.23. Then we have a gourmet meal that I haven't even talked about how you cook it, which I'll talk about in just one moment, but it takes our total to $15.53 for the day. All of that food right? A smoothie for breakfast with fruit, mac nuts. You get your all-in-one powder, choose some chocolate or vanilla. You put your water in there. You blend it up. You've got a frozen smoothie on the run. Now you've got a huge salad with tomato, with carrots cut up, olive oil, hemp hearts, or sardines. And for dinner, you're doing rice cauliflower, broccoli, wild salmon, a filet, and you're doing either half an avocado or your olive oil to keep the budget down a bit. All that for $15.53. I mean, pretty amazing, right? Now, how do you make this gourmet dinner? It sounds it sounds so extravagant. No, you can literally make it in a toaster oven, which I have in my office uh, more times than you could imagine. Here's what I do. I put a piece of frozen salmon, not even thawed, not even thawed, a piece of frozen salmon on that, um, I put it on parchment paper, on that uh, silver tray, right? That metal tray inside of a toaster oven. And then I put a cup and a half of broccoli there. And then I put a cup and a half of rice cauliflower. And I cook that for about 30 to 35 minutes at 350 degrees in a toaster oven. I take it out and I put it on a compostable plate with my bamboo or compostable based utensils, uh, which is just a fork, by the way, or a spork. And then spork is probably one of the greatest inventions ever. And then you, I pour olive oil on it with a touch of sea salt. And that is a lunch sometimes for me, if I need a bigger lunch, if I'm going to do a bigger workout, whatever it might be. Or I do that and I just add hemp arts to the top of it. So we're not talking about gourmet cooking here. What are you doing? Oh, you get home. Day was a long day, hard day. 
frozen broccoli, frozen cauliflower, frozen piece of salmon. You take it out, you add some olive oil on top, some sea salt, and you've got a phenomenal meal. Now, am I saying that there's, am I saying that, that there isn't healthier ways of doing it? There's certainly healthier ways of doing it, no doubt about it. But what's better, eating a sub, eating McDonald's, eating Wendy's, eating a you know spicy, crispy chicken sandwich, or pizza, right? What's healthier, right? Uh, well, this is healthier by a mile, right? So pretty amazing, easy to make. These are basically no prep, right? You wouldn't need to wait 30 minutes for your, your dinner to cook. That's not really too much to ask for sure for uh, for a five dollar and thirty cents meal. So fifteen fifty three for the day. So we did it. I'm gonna put everything linked up for you today. And I did want to add a note for those people though who are looking to add a little bit more carbs for the day. Super easy uh, for you. You could certainly do rice. There's no doubt about it. But an easy thing to do is to pre-prep. You could pre-prep your uh, sweet potato or yam. Cook it for an hour uh, the night before, the day before, whatever you'd like to do. And um, you can have a Japanese yam or a sweet potato or a purple potato for $1.99 per pound. So if you need some serious starch and carbs in your diet for an extra $1.99 for the day, or if you need one at lunch and one at dinner, there you go. You're looking at still uh, at four more dollars. You're looking at nineteen dollars and fifty three cents. So you're still, if you want the start, you're still under twenty dollars for the day uh, for someone that wants to gain more weight or they need a little bit more starch in their diet. So hopefully this was helpful. Again, um, really, what it's all about is making things easy, taking the excuses away from yourself. But honestly, most people don't make excuses. I mean, they, they really don't. It's a lack of information. It really is. So once you get the information and it's simplified, you can say, okay, I can copy that. I can do that. And I believe that you can. So I'm going to link up everything for you today. Uh, including previous Mediterranean-based shows, A Day in the Life of My Mediterranean Diet, The Foundation of All Diets. I'll link those up, plus this shopping list and the pricing at stephencabral.com forward slash 2007. Take care, everyone. Have an amazing day. Feel free to share this show with anyone you believe it could serve. If you can believe it, it is already August, and that means in just about three weeks or so, the kids are headed back to school. We get back into a more normal base routine, I guess you could call it. And with that, we need to make sure we're getting our eating on track and also feeding our kids good, healthy, nutritious meals. But in addition to the normal breakfast, lunch, and dinner, sometimes you need an easy go-to. And that's exactly why we created our organic whole food bars over at Equalife. These bars are the cleanest bars on the planet. Literally, you cannot put cleaner ingredients in a bar. Everything is organic or it's wild. Uh, you're looking at a very low calorie snack bar in general, but it also has enough of that sweet in order for you to feel like your cravings been satisfied. It's great for kids. It's also nice to have a couple if you need it as a meal replacement. And right now over at Equal Life, you can get any flavor you'd like, a full box completely free. That's around a $25 value, completely free right now. And again, you can choose from the sunny date, you can choose the lemon uh, ginger goodness, the chocolate based bar flavors, or the apple cinnamon. Uh, literally, everyone has different tastes. They're all delicious. Choose your favorite one get a bunch if you're ordering uh, with family and uh, and try them out. So that is the thing. I'm telling you right now, one of the most popular bars out there right now, the organic whole food bars, select your favorite flavor on all qualifying orders over $129 over at Equal Life right now. So pick up your favorite protocol, your lab test that you've been looking to do, anything else, stock up and get a free box on us completely free right now while supplies last over at equi.life.e.